In this video, I'm going to show you how to package an Affinity Publisher document. Affinity Publisher allows you to create packaged documents and folders, which is useful for compiling resources into a single location. I'm going to package this magazine, which contains a variety of fonts and a number of linked resources. So I'll go to Menu and tap Package. A warning about using restricted fonts will appear, and this will advise you to check your font's licensing agreement. Once checked, we'll tap OK and this will bring up the package document dialog. The dialog gives us a summary of the fonts and images used within the document. We can see here that this document uses 17 fonts, zero of which are missing, but nine are restricted. I can select the font section on the left for more details. Each font which has been used within the document is displayed in a list alongside its status. None are missing, but we do have some fonts that are restricted, and these are restricted as they require a license for usage. I already have a license for all of the fonts used within this document, but as a designer, it's always something we have to be mindful of. The same process can be followed for images. By selecting the image section on the left, we can see we have a list of images used within the document and their status. If I go back to the summary screen, I can see I have two more options that I can select. By default, Affinity Publisher automatically includes the font and image files in the package folder. If for any reason you don't want to include these resources in your package, you can deselect these options here. For the moment though, we will include them in the package folder. With my document checked, I'll tap Package, and this will open up my file app. I can then choose where I want to save my package file. We'll go ahead and create a new folder, and we'll call this one Astro Fashion Magazine. I'll then tap Done, and once again, Done to confirm. Affinity Publisher will then begin packaging the document. Opening our file app allows us to see the file structure that we have created. We can see here that we have the packaged file, along with all of the images and fonts used within the document. To open the package file, we'll simply tap on the file, and once again, the package document dialog will appear. Publisher can temporarily install any fonts that are not installed locally on your iPad. To do this, we simply enable the install option here for each of the fonts. Using the image section again, I can check that all of the images are present and correct. I'll then tap open to continue loading the document. And here we have our packaged Affinity Publisher file. And that's how to create a packaged file in Publisher 2 for iPad. Thank you for watching.